Hello everybody and welcome back to Easy Medicine. After a long summer holiday at my parents, I'm finally back at home and I'm back on the medical grind. In today's video, we're gonna talk about the color of your urine. Not a lot of people talk about it, but from a medical point of view, it's very interesting. And you are going to learn today what the colors of your urine tell you about your current health state. Before we get into the video, if you want more medical content, of course, subscribe to this channel and like the video if you enjoy the content. Let's get into it. Before we talk about the color of the urine, we have to talk about why do we have to pee in the first place? Why? Well, we need to excrete urea. Urea is a metabolite of our protein metabolism. And to excrete urea, we have to solve it in something liquid and excrete it. And this is the reason why we have to pee. And as we metabolize each and every day proteins, we have to pee each and every day. And the minimum amount of urine we have to produce in one day is 500 milliliters. The main component of urine is, surprise, it's water. 95% of your urine volume is water. The other components of urine are uric acids, creatinine, amino acids, metabolites of hormones and of course inorganic components as sodium, potassium, sulfur and chloride. So why has urine a color if it's 95% water? In the urine there are urochromes. The red blood cells mature with time and as they reach a certain age they have to die. As they die the hemoglobin inside of them is metabolized. Here bilirubin is produced and this bilirubin gets metabolized in the liver and one of the parts that is metabolized from it is urobilinogen and this is excreted with the urine and has this yellow brownish color and gives the urine its characteristic yellowish color. You've just seen colorless urine. This is a product of urine you get when you drink a lot of liquids. You absorb these liquids in your guts and these are taken up to the bloodstream. But as this would raise the blood pressure a lot, your body has to get rid of it. So the body excretes it in urine. And the urine is colorless because of the high amounts of urine, the concentration of the urochromes is very low, so it's nearly colorless. This is the normal color of urine. There is a decent amount of urochromes inside the urine, but this is totally normal and absolutely healthy. This extremely brown urine may have two different origins. Reason number one is you are dehydrated. This happens after a night of drinking or after being out all day and simply you forgot to drink anything. So the concentration of urochromes is very very high in the urine and uh, you've not peed a lot. So it gets a brown color. This is option number one. The second option is that you have a liver disease. The liver cannot metabolize the bilirubin anymore so the body tries to excrete more bilirubin than normal through the kidneys and the urine. This is red urine. It may have two different reasons. One is absolutely benign. You have just eaten beets and the color from the beets is absorbed in the body and excreted through the urine. So if you got red urine after eating beets, you don't have to worry. The second option is different. There is a possibility that you get kidney stones. These kidney stones migrate to the urinary tract and might damage the urethra, the gallbladder, the ureter and this causes a bleeding. And the last option is that it's a malignant tumor that has ingrown into the urinary tract causing damage to the mucosa or to nearby vessels and causing a bleeding into the urine. This is definitely an indication to go and see a doctor.
Now it's getting fancy. Green urine is a really rare sight. The cause might be a side effect of drugs you've taken. The other option is a UTI, so a urinary tract infection with bacteria. So go see a doctor and get it evaluated. And last but not least, you have seen the purple urine back syndrome. Due to an uh, inlaid catheter in the urinary tract, um, bacteria are able to populate um, the inner linings of the ureter and these bacteria produce an enzyme and these enzymes cause um, the purple discoloration of the urine. Really, really rare sight. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys learned some new and interesting things and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.